Alright, welcome back. Me and Jesse got the Hop Avenger IPA going down your gullet. Look at him. Flying bone. Last time you seen a flying bone was me buck naked in the living room. <laughs> <laughs> now the thing is, what Jesse doesn't know is this one, the other one, and all three of these I've already done reviews of. But I haven't uploaded them yet. This one, that one, and then the what? The other two that are like this. Oh, really? I've done five reviews, but I haven't uploaded them. Because I was like, trash them, I'm going to go do it with Jesse's house. Uh-oh. And then he can rewatch them and go, yeah, never mind, I'm going to put this one back in. Nah. <laughs> we got these red lobster glasses. Fancy. I really, we need to like look up how old these are. Pretty old. Man, you remember back uh, when Red Lobster had the uh, little 8 ounce Corona bottles and you could use them as a salt pepper shaker? You get, it was at Red Lobster. And you had to get them. Never really went to Red Lobster. Okay, well, years ago, fuck, f at least 15 years ago, uh, me and my wife stole them from Red Lobster. They were salt and pepper shakers? We just took the caps. I got them on 12 ounce. <laughs> A Corona and a Corona light bottle. Oh. Yeah, it just claps, it like caps on, and it's got holes oh, in it. Oh, that's pretty neat. Woo. It's like a skunk fart, uh, farted, skunk sprayed a peach. <laughs> skunk farted a peach. <laughs> I guess it kind of works that way, too. Yeah. <laughs> Farts peach out, Queef. sprays me. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. What you think? Uh, stinky peach. Yeah. <laughs> I need help. <laughs> right. Are they quite good? They're thick. Yeah. Mm. I think I had a nice little zipper. I get some pineapple and peach. I'm Damn. definitely getting that. It's almost like that starts out the sweetness of like pineapple and then hits you with a like bolder peach taste. Yeah, more like more towards the pit. Yeah. Oh, but it's it's dry. Yeah, it goes away quick dryness. I wouldn't say it's bitter, I say it's just dry. Yeah. It gives you that like scratchy tongue dry mm -hmm. feeling. Fucked up before Brittany gets here. She'll be like, uh, y'all about to start one? Huh? <laughs> it's 7 30. What time should she get here? About 8. Uh, it's time to get, well, get food. So. Tracker here. Yeah, the flavors aren't that in depth. You get those two flavors and then some dryness. Pineapple peach. Yeah. That's about it. Good flavor up front, dives off pretty quick, and then it's just dry. I'm not even getting any like hot bitterness really. Uh -huh. <sighs> so I don't know. I like it though. Yeah, it was good. Definitely something to have with food. Chicken. Some fried fucking chicken. Mm, some greasy chicken. Oh. Fuck that. Fried fish with some lemon and some fucking tartar sauce because you get the lemon kind of note thing on with it. Oh, okay. And the fat and the, the grease from the fucking chicken or the chicken, the, the fish being fried I think would mix pretty well with the, mm. the dryness. Except me when I do fish it's usually more like vinegar. Mm. So you like the brown ale type shit? A little roasty? Because I, I, I like to do malt vinegar with my fish. Ashley does too. She'll stab the fucking fish yeah. and just dump yeah. the shit on If we there. go somewhere like a uh, was a fish place, fast food one. Long John's? Yeah, we go to like Long John's or something, I get them fish. Stab the shit out of them, I just drown them motherfuckers in malt vinegar. I just put the tartar sauce on it, call it good. <clears throat> no, here we go to the Red Lobster. Fucking big shout out. Someone stole your glasses. <laughs> I'm in possession of stolen <laughs> they property. Bought <laughs> <laughs> they bought stolen property. Well, yeah, well. Y'all know where I live. Uh, Can you let us know what year they're from? <laughs> You can look. 
Google it. Um, I, there's really nothing wrong with this beer besides the ex, little excessive dryness. Yeah, that's the only thing that I'm not big on is I'm how dry it gets at the end. It's got good flavor, but I'm glad it's not excessive. Yeah. 7.7% get the job done. You'll be having your dick out and decent exposure charges in no time. And with the dryness on the end, you're going to be drinking it pretty goddamn quick because you're going to get thirsty. 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 Yep. So I have you a white claw ready. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, you spin? Yeah, I think. I, sure, why not? I don't remember. <laughs> I think you do. Uh, like we said, it's, it, it, it's, there's no extra nuances or anything added to the end of this beer it's just strictly pineapple to peach dryness sahara desert uh fucking meat mills booty hole before p diddy stuck his fucking tongue to it he licked it like a fucking nine volt he's like i love the goddamn shocking feeling uh i'm gonna go ahead and say hey what up your daughter's like 30 feet over there i'm gonna give it that <laughs> Okay, uh. Too busy listening to all the crap you were saying. Had me all off guard. Uh, Meek Mill! Um. I think I'd give it an eight. I said nine. I like it. Just the dryness. Yep, dryness is what killed me. Yep. Alright, so there you go. We've seen you.